<laughs> yes, I would say glad to be back inside with you guys. I'm glad to be on the desk with y'all, but the weather was quite nice outside. I yeah. wish we could take the whole newscast outside today. Look at the skies across all of central Alabama. Seeing some sunshine, seeing some clouds, but everyone is feeling the heat on this February afternoon. 75 right now up in Etowah County. We have 75 in Anniston with 71 in Hamilton. Look at that setting sun there in Tuscaloosa. 78 is the current temperature in T Town. As we look at those temps in East Alabama, mid 70s, low 70s in Coleman. Just just beautiful across the state again. New record was set today, 79 degrees, beating our previous record by three whole degrees, not tying or just beating it by one degree. Yesterday, we only beat it by one degree. Today, we're showing out by three degrees. So this today will go on the record books as our new record. So we're looking at cold air moving in from the west. That's allowing for some rain out ahead of this cold front. Some light showers now developing in northwest Alabama. And then the ba main bulk of that wet weather is going to arrive later on tonight for most of central Alabama. I do want to go ahead and get to your future cast because we can go ahead and break through this timing, the timeline of this wet weather. So six o'clock tonight, that rain's going to be in west uh, and central Alabama. So within the next hour or so, there could be a few light showers by 9 o'clock. Birmingham, Asheville, and Talladega seeing some light rain. But again, that's just going to be that initial line. We probably will see rain all of 10 minutes with this uh, uh, leading edge. But then a little break in the rain. And then the bulk of the rain arrives really after you go to sleep tonight. So from about 11 p.m. through midnight, that's when that rain moves into northwest Alabama. But check out what happens. Look at the time 11 p.m. And look at the temperature range from 40 in Hamilton at that hour to 57 in Alexander City. So there's going to be some big differences from one side of the state to the other as this cold front moves through. And then that rain continues to march across the state through the early morning hours on Friday. And it really kind of moves out of here just in time for rush hour. Could be a few leftover showers early on in the day. But notice these temperatures. Hamilton, 30 degrees for your Friday morning, whereas Alexander City will still be holding in the 40s. I expect those temperatures to actually drop even more after daybreak as this cold air settles in, but we'll see a slight jump in those temperatures through the afternoon. So uh, as far as rain goes for the remainder of Friday, there could be a couple of isolated showers popping up here and there. Some of that could change over into a little bit of snow. I know that the dreaded snow word, right? But there's not going to be any accumulation whatsoever, but mainly in North Alabama, some of that rain could change over into a flurry or two just because of that cold air. So keep in mind, lows tonight will range between the low 30s, 31 for your low in Hamilton, 39 in Birmingham. Highs tomorrow, though, only in the 40s. Some places may hit 50, but those will be few and far between. Sunshine's back for the weekend, but the trade off, some much cooler air. Look at those 20s Saturday morning with highs in the 50s Saturday and Sunday.